Oh, and it's got the manual. PDK. <laughs> uh, the blue one had the manual, the black one had the PDK. Yo, it's supercharged. No way, dude, what is it? Yeah. Looks like a prowler. <laughs> All right, guys, I saw one of these the other day. What is this? EV400 I-Pace. Guys, it looked like a forged carbon. Really? Yo, what do you think about that, uh, Jag? Dude, there's an Aston Martin Zubato up there on the avenue. Wanna go? Let's walk. It's the convertible one. Let's walk. It's not even the regular one. Nice. Um, okay. Guys, the color. Blue with red guts. Steve, this is incredible. This wasn't here yesterday. Yeah. Hey, look. It's a it's an F boy, Steve. Behind you, red Hellcat. Guys, this 300 SL is absolutely beautiful. Immaculate spec. Immaculate. It's crazy. Look at the interior. Red oh. guts. <clears throat> it's, it's ridiculous. I wish they took the top off of this and that though. It'd make my day a little bit better. What, so you could get a get a better look inside? Sorry, Andrew. No, this is ridiculously gorgeous. Here, this like, come on. Wow. What'd you take, Steve? 300 SL or CGT? CGT Audio. Really? Yeah. I daily drive it. I bet you if can't you daily drive this. I bet if you kept the 300 SL for a few years, you'd be able to cop several new hypercars. It's probably this is like the most beautiful car ever made. Crazy looking. Imagine this color with gall wings, dude. Yeah, I get it. 95 bucks? That's a steal, dude. If it's not gone by the end of the day, I'll get it. Alright. Why are they hiding this stuff from us? Yeah, passenger seat. Mirage. Hey, look, it's a Yo, that Lyra Roadster is so incredible. Oh, this thing's wild. Steve, do you know anything about this? Yeah, it's Glickenhouses. Oh, this is Glickenhouses. He's right there. Oh, yeah. That's crazy. Yeah, this is awesome. Yo, this is incredible. This is brand new. This is his brand new. Yo, the carbon fiber on this is out of control. I know. This thing is incredible. So, would you take this or the Hoira Roadster? I'm going to go take a look at that. Nice car. Escoy? What? Escoy, what do you want to know? This is, this is our 003S. This is, used to be 
Um, our old race car. Okay. Uh, this ran this specific chassis ran two 24 hours in Nurburgring before oh, wow. we made it into this. Um, this one's currently powered by the twin turbo BMW V8. Okay. Out of the M5 And then um, this this one has a seven speed automatic. Okay. Uh, that goes with that engine. So, so what what are the numbers? It weighs around roughly 26, 2700 pounds. Um, depending on the engine map, it makes around 725. Okay. Okay. It's um, crazy. Fast enough to get you arrested it, anywhere in the world. Is this road legal? Yes, this is 50 state legal. Wow. Like I said, fast enough to get you arrested anywhere. <laughs> Anyone returning to the show has the always have an incredible selection of exotic cars, and in particular, okay. they, they seem to have an exotic for every purpose. I, I mean, we're not talking about just vehicles. Oh, this cars, is incredible. You know, yeah, yeah. 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 Love the lights on the side here. Yeah, this is your fuel, your oil, and your pit position. That's really cool. That's really cool. But it's a lot different than a than a Biron. I mean, it's based on a real race car. Yeah, you know, thanks for showing us the car. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, absolutely. This car, um, definitely a, uh, you know, more of a fun and, and spirited vibe to this car. I'm gonna take a look at the uh, high roads. So. Yeah, go ahead. It's great that Aston Martin has been able to you know, hang on, survive, and thrive. But for those of us who have more than one friend, okay, we might want... Uh, uh, like, you gotta be careful like, not hitting the people. Yeah. Not hitting the people. <laughs> everything in the car. We had, you know, we've been taking the whole What? The plate room. I love this thing. It looks so cool. I know, I know. It's so much more accentuated from the actual Huayra. <laughs> Just wait till they open the entire thing. Are they going to? Probably. When? Hey, what's uh, your favorite car here? I don't know. It's so hard. Um, it's it's between this and the Huayra Roadster. I love this. <laughs> I love the Roadster. The Kintosh. The MSOX, eh, the P1's cool, but this, 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 this is an original, that's an original, that's an original, the driver is actually here, they drove that, uh -huh. dude, it's just, so this is a, a road car, road yeah, race so, car. yeah, 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 it's just amazing, but honestly, for practicality reasons and for daily drivability, I'd go with the Roadster. I'll go with this G240. For a daily driver? Yeah. Okay. I, I... Jimmy chose to uh, have a full fender car, um, and some of these things you'll see without the fenders on them at all. Yeah, so then we've got a car here that was was a creation by this gentleman named Tucker, and boy, this took the country by storm. It really did. In 1947-48, Preston Tucker announced the car of tomorrow today. And he was so rare that he wanted to make Miles customer. Maybe this is a thing. But we wouldn't take it original Tucker and, and modify it. So we've been in the next test that we made. Each other from Five years ago, and I had a couple of animals, and Jack, for all the things that we've been for the last 60 years. Uh, 
Thank you for having me. I live here in Brighton. Uh, uh, she lives in a part of the and down in Europe. Category. Uh, this money, reputation, wasn't too good. So they built 51 uh, cars, of which 47 survived. A shameless plug here, we're having Tuckers at Pebble Beach this year for the first time. We celebrate the 70th anniversary of the Tucker. But this is no ordinary. You know, um, we're talking about a special Tucker here, but going along with that same thought, uh, I have a car called the Davis, and Gary Davis. Guys, what is going on? La Ferrari with red stripes. This is ridiculous. Look at all the leapers. <laughs> it's just parked up right here. Oh, it's incredible. You see the gray Alcantara? Yeah. It's 10499. <laughs> yes, sir. Today's a beautiful day for cars, right? Oh, I know, right? They both right have they both have V12s. Oh, M40i getting after it. <laughs> What'd you say? Yo, yeah, Bentley. Oh yeah. Dude, this is insanity. I love it. I love it too. I think mine's a little bit worse than yours, my farmer stand. <laughs> Steve, 48 or for La Ferrari? No, I'm not talking about the Beautiful stuff. Oh, thank you very much. You're welcome. Is that a Richard Miller? Very nice watch. Thank you. It's beautiful. I'm gonna get this cold start. walk a mile for? So, Brandon just called me and said that they're unloading a Bugatti Chiron. They're unloading? Okay. Yes. Okay, how do we get there? Guys, this is the speed limit in Greenwich, 120. D that, not, that, that's not the speed limit, that is. <laughs> Steve, what is in front of us? That is a Bugatti Chiron. Oh my god. <laughs> Probably. Yeah, I've gotten to drive a Veyron before. Yeah. It's crazy. Yo, what are the odds? Guys, Watch out. Warren Greenwich, Bugatti Sharon behind me, of course. We don't sleep. You know, people have been telling me to step my game up. Well, boom, there you go. Yeah, Sharon. A1. So low. So aggressive in person. Oh my god. Have you seen one yet? No, this is my first time. Oh, really? I yep. saw the very first one that got delivered to Miller's, and they were like, You're good, man. You can't yeah. post any of those pictures. Yeah. Well, now? So, uh, I asked. You want to get it in there and they come back? What do you want to do? 
I think it's just water. Cool. Yeah. That's locked. Air That's just water. Air right? conditioning. <laughs> By the AC. Yeah. This is crazy. Oh, you must bumpers. What's that? Oh, it has a Sharonka too. That's awesome right there. Blue with red guts, dude. That's that's my uh, that's my weakness. That's sexy. Wow, dude, this is so cool. Gotta get that start up. Guys, the saga continues with me and Bugatti. It's meant to be. Veyron Drive, Sharon Delivery. Let's go. Sharon. Guys, I'm so sweaty. I'm drenched. Every pore on my body is sweating. What just happened? Oh my god. Alright guys, so I was going to the bank. <laughs> and this is what you get when you walk around Greenwich. This is the first Enzo I've seen in the wild. Love your car, man. <laughs> that was such a treat. Thank you so much. Bugatti Veyron. Bugatti Chiron. And a lot for our Bro, we've Enzo. seen five Veyrons. And this month I've seen two Enzos, an MC12, seven Veyrons. I know, I kind of forgot for this girl. I'm absolutely so good. Bro. Dude, get the start up. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh. Ice cream truck. <laughs> always get the truck, guys. You always gotta get the truck, guys. This is an eighteen thousand dollar Ferrari gas cap. No joke. <laughs> What'd you say, Steve? It would look nice on the wall. Yeah, it would look look nice on my bedroom wall. Exactly. Yeah.